Well, welcome back you guys. We are out in the garden today and it is time to start ripping this garden out and getting ready for fall gardening. So let me show you what we got going on and what's all coming out today and gonna start getting ready for fall gardening. This garden is completely overgrown and it is time to get a lot of cleaning done where we can get some of our fall gardening planted. This bed right here where we had the rainbow swiss chard, it is going to be coming out the rainbow swiss chard, all the sunflowers, all these daisies. The only thing I'm leaving is my petunias. So this bed is going to be completely empty and getting amended to get planted up. It is time to get the cabbage and the kale all up. As you can tell, it is done, it is dying back, and it's just been eaten up. So we are going to get this out and get it ready for planting for fall. The eggplants are completely done. As you can tell, they are dying back. They don't have any leaves and we are done with them. So these will be coming out and getting cleaned up. And as of the walkways too, we'll be getting a good clean. I was knocked down, heard the countdown through the haze in the face of defeat, yeah. I was ruled out with no bail out on my own, all alone, left to bleed out. But I rose up from the ground, just like I was real bound, all the odds were against me. So I picked up the page, and now. I've got this all cleaned out but I want to show you what happened on one of the fruits that I um, dropped and I think I'm gonna be able to save seeds off these um, eggplants that I didn't get to pick so let me show you and then we're gonna try to save seeds off these eggplants for next year okay I don't know if you guys can see that but when I drop that, all those seeds come rushing out. So I think all the ones that are really ripe like that, that I'm going to be able to save seeds the from. The green beans are completely done. It is time to get them ripped out and to start getting the bed where the cabbage and kale and the green beans are cleaned up. That way when we get our fall garden all designed up, it will be ready to plant for fall gardening. I met you in the dark, it was a Saturday night I Remember seeing you just dancing in the middle of the crowd There was something about you cause you got stuck in my mind Stuck in my mind, stuck in my mind I thought I'd give it a go and I started talking to you I don't know what I said but the next thing I knew Is that I held you in my arms and you asked what we should do What should we do, what should we do I said you can do what you want to with me Yeah I won't mind as long as you stay with me, I'm alright. I wanna hold ya. Alright you guys, we're here at the green beans and I've been leaving a lot of these pods on here because I'm going to be saving seeds. So let me just show you.
You just let them dry on the vine, crack them open, and then I have seeds for next year. So cool. It's silent now, we don't say a word, we're just looking at each other. Tears in our eyes from the words we said, yeah, it kind of broke my heart. Loving you is not so goddamn easy as you think. I'm trying my best to hold on, but I feel myself giving. You know that we shouldn't keep it up like this, we hurt each other's feelings on and on. There's all the green beans from that green bean roll. We ended up getting a little bit of green beans still left on the, the plants. I've got a ton of seed pods that are ready to be cracked open and saved for seeds. Not a whole lot, but I do have enough to hopefully put back for next year. Here is the green bean roll. It took me longer than what I expected to pull them all out just because I was trying to save the peas, the seed pods, and then there is the pile that I will be giving to my chickens. The archway is going to get cleaned up on this side where the Kajari melons, the uh, squash bugs completely killed it. So it's time to get this all out of here and cleaned up to start planting peas in. The cucumbers are completely done. So it is time to get them cleaned up. And then we have the red noodle beans. They are all grown and as you can tell I kept a lot on the vine where I can save the seeds but they are ready to come out and possibly get more planted for fall. And look at the watermelon vines completely through the walkway. Lots of watermelons. The cherry tomatoes that got messed up during the storm have really been struggling so it is time to get them ripped out and get this bed amended and take down the trellis and get it ready for fall planting. Welcome back you guys. We are out here. It is the next day. It is time for us to get started on this bed right here with the Swiss chard and the sunflowers. Uh, it's time to get them cleaned up as bad as I would hate to get rid of the Swiss chard. It is looking a little tattered, but we are going to be growing more of it for the fall. And I can't wait because I got some really beautiful colors. So let's get this bed cleaned up and get ready for fall planting. Yeah, it's a day. I'm hanging in the sunshine You should hit me with a splash gun So I cool down Won't you come on over We can party till the sun's down Baby, let me buy you a drink While we're dancing to blink I could go for some queen bait too Bass is going boom
guys we've got this bed all done um, it's not perfect I left a little bit of the residue in there to continue to break down and compost down just to feed the soil um, so this bed is now ready to be planted up for fall I hope that you guys enjoyed seeing how we are cleaning the garden out and getting it ready for fall gardening. Stay tuned for the upcoming videos that shows you how I am planting my fall gardening and how we are going to be planting it out. And as always, thank you for watching. Until the next video, God bless.